Good morning, today is Friday, October 16th and I'm going to be vlogging for the day. Um, for the month of October, every Friday I have been trying to do something that is fall or Halloween themed. And today we're carving pumpkins. Adrian and I went to the pumpkin patch last Friday. I can insert some clips. And these are the pumpkins we got. We have these two big pumpkins. This one's Pedro's and that one's mine. And then we have these three pumpkins that we're going to paint. I'm not sure how that's gonna go, but we'll see. We got these brushes and paint. And if I didn't mention, I don't think I did, but our theme for this year is going to be Star Wars. Jedi is gonna be Dark Vader for Halloween. Even though we don't do anything for Halloween, we're gonna take pictures and watch movies. And so we want to still enjoy the holiday season. I ordered these from Amazon because I haven't seen any like pumpkin carving tools at Target like I usually do. All these tools that we're gonna use and so I'm excited to see how our pumpkins are gonna come out and so and we're also gonna have a few friends over to carve pumpkins with us so that should be fun all right so um, it's currently 12:43, and Jedediah just finished eating his lunch we are about to leave but before we leave I'm burping him and now I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a two-month update for Jedediah um, this time I actually took notes of things I want to cover and so I made sure hopefully I can cover everything real quick. He just turned two months last Tuesday, but he's currently nine weeks. He is in a size one diaper. He wears zero to three clothing. He is awake for so long now. He'll be up from maybe 30 minutes all the way up until like two to three hours. Um, we notice he's starting to like not want to take his naps like he gets a little fussy around that time so what we've been doing is swaddling him um more often during the day we usually swaddle him only at night but it's been helping to swaddle him during his nap so he can actually get a good nap in before maybe like when he was one month he would go to sleep at like nine o'clock wake up at 12 to eat go to sleep wake up at three to eat so he was eating every three hours and he still does eat every three hours but at night when we put him down for his last like to go to sleep um, anywhere between 9 to 10 o'clock he'll sleep all the way up until about 3 o'clock so I try to make his last feeding at 9 and then he'll eat stay up for a bit and then and then he'll go to sleep and won't wake up until about 3 3 30 right before he turned two months he was sleeping um, in the bed with us still because of our concern with his acid reflux so, but at his two month checkup which was the day after he turned two months the doctor recommended to make sure we are keeping him in his bassinet for safety concerns which is what we already knew but just to help us feel comfortable we were propping him up and having him sleep on his boppy in the middle of the bed and i know it's probably not the safest but it worked for us to get through a couple weeks and now he, every night he's sleeping in his bassinet he's taking multiple naps in his crib i usually try to t let him take one nap with me but i don't always take my naps and I'm always doing something, but I want to try to make sure I'm taking at least one nap with him just to spend time with him. Um, his acid reflux has, has gotten so much better. Tomorrow is actually his last dosage. He was only supposed to take it for one month, so he's going to be off of his medicine. And I'm going to continue a dairy-free diet and just keep an eye out on him. Um, things he's enjoying to do like at this time is just kind of look around. Um, he's been smiling still a lot responding but when we're in the car he will open the sunroof because it goes like all the way back and he loves to look out the window up there and it's so cute because now when we get in the car we're considering him and his comfort so we open the thing and let him see out the window this is pacifier and oh my gosh he loves watching the tv like he i don't know if it's just like the flashing like movements and everything happening but anytime you lay this boy down he will be turning his neck to try to look at the tv and i try not to let him do it because i know like i want him to develop his eye strength and i don't want it to overstimulate him like his brain but sometimes he just be resting and just doing it and sometimes that's the only thing that'll calm him down but i'm not okay with him watching the tv i just let him for a few seconds some things he's not enjoying he still wait well, actually last week we had a really good bath time where he was not fussing during the bath or after the bath usually when he does is when he's cold he did not fuss at all 
Um, so I don't know if he's enjoying his bath. I mean, his not bath. He loves his bath, but he doesn't enjoy the drying process and getting dressed after. So I think he's gotten better at that. Um, he still doesn't really like to be changed. Like, if he's really hungry, he doesn't have the patience to get changed before he eats. So sometimes I'll just feed him, but I really like to change him before so that we're not laying him on his back right after he eats. Some trips that he's made during this past month was just a trip to Bakersfield and to Pismo Beach again. He did go to the zoo um, for the first time. And he did really good. He was not fussing. He was just awake, smiling, happy. And then he would go to sleep and then feed. Like, he did really good. And, yeah, I feel like he's super close to rolling over. He loves to lift his head up. Um, look around. As you can see, he's awake. Right now, he's just resting. He just woke up from a nap. And that's pretty much it for his two-month update. I'm going to continue his little monthly updates as he gets older. But they probably will just be in a vlog, so it won't just be a full video on him. Maybe his 6 month and his 12 months will be, but the in-between months will just be incorporated into a vlog. We're going to go and have lunch, and we'll see what else we're going to do. Jedediah took a nap, and I woke him up because I was messing with his nose. Okay, but was I was taking his boogers out, and he woke up cranky. And this fool took like three hours playing. Come on, babe. What? Say yeah. <laughs> what? We just got to this taco truck that we're about to eat our first meal at. It's this place called, how do you say it, babe? Colimas. Colimas. I'm about to get a burrito. I'm really hungry and I'm about to devour it. All right, let's go. So let's go. Uh-huh. We got into the big present of care for free with our Toyota. This is the menu for the fair. And I'm at four and five on this side. We're going to six. Everything else to the left of the spread row. Okay, thank you. We're going to get some funnel cake. You said four and six? Yeah. We're going to six on the, he said to the left, right? So for the big Fresno Fair, I don't know if you guys heard me, but if you have a Toyota vehicle, you get into the fair for free. And so they have all these booths. So numbers one, numbers one through 20. And we came for some funnel cake. So we need to go to number six. And we have all these cars. We got in the wrong lane because Pedro doesn't listen. Pedro got a churro. Taste test. Good? Mm. Tastes like a churro. Is it soft? No. That's the thing with churros Tastes is good. I need it to be nice and soft. Okay. I don't know my strawberry funnel cake. Woo! Damn, they put a lot of whipped cream. So I'm not supposed to eat all of this crap. Get out your feelings. They also have here sounded like really nasty. Say hi, Bobas. Say hi. <laughs> what are you saying, Bobas? <laughs> so this is my look for tonight. Um, I'm pretty much wearing the same thing I had on earlier, except I changed my shirt. I was wearing a black tank top, but I put a t-shirt on. Little boy over here is sleepy but doesn't want to take his nap. So I'm gonna try to put him to sleep. It's almost 5.30. And we extended this table here so that we have more space to work. Peace. It does smell bad. Can you open that please? Yeah. Here. Cause you keep messing it up. Yeah. Yeah.
<laughs> we have Mario's pumpkin, my unfinished pumpkin, Bailey's pumpkin, yeah. Bailey Martinez's pumpkin, <laughs> Destiny's pumpkin, <laughs> and then Peter's pumpkin. Oh, he's being extra. All right, that's the end of this vlog. We baked some cookies with Mario. Baked us some cookies. It is 12 o'clock. We're just about to play. I'm about to pump and go to sleep. I feel like my eyes are so red. I'm so tired. Oh, and my pumpkin got fucked up. Everyone's pumpkin came out really good except mine. I was like half asleep, tired. I wasn't too worried about it. I'll probably just buy a new one or just not make one. But we are going to paint these ones sometime this week. But alright you guys, I will see you guys next time on my next video.